I think Bill Trailer is probably the greatest artist you've never heard of, but he's getting heard of more and more. Trailer's an inspired visualist. That's the only way you arrive at work that's that distinct, that esoteric, that visually elegant and refined. Bill Trailer lived his life between two radically different worlds, rural and urban, old and new, black and white. He is engaging with issues around class, how we behave and how we treat one another, sometimes good and sometimes not so good. I see a very animated, agitated, violent, mystical realm. Bill Trailer was born into slavery in 1853 near Pleasant Hill, just outside Benton, Alabama. In the last years of his life, he lived in the city of Montgomery. One of the things that people talk about when you go to a New York City is a city that never sleeps. That's the way they talked about Monroe Street. He was witness to the rise of an African-American culture. The transcendent surprise is that all the while, he was nurturing a remarkable creative gift that would not be expressed for decades. There, he took it upon himself to pick up a pencil and paintbrush and put down the story of his life in the way that he could in pictures. I could place his work next to anyone and he would still stand out. When I see Bill Trill's work, I see this yearning for a place that's beyond here. It's a place that's not tangible.